Continuing with the second half of the prices right at the end of the week, Joshua played bonus game for a brand new bed, and he successfully got all four of the windows. And even if he didn't get the last window correct, he still would have won the bonus because it was in the second window. So we got our first big win of the day. In Lucky 7, James played for a Chevy HHR. First number was 2. He said the second number was a 3, was a 1, cost him $2. He believed the third number was a 6, cost him $2 more, was a 4. The fourth number, he believed it was a 7, it was a 5, cost him 2 more dollars. So he had one dollar left, and he had to get the last number exactly right. He said nine, well, the last number was nine! And when I watched, watched that happen, I gave him a round of applause. He rightfully deserves that. What, what a win there. Great job. In flip-flop, Angela played for a trip to Barcelona. And the wrong price was seven thousand eight nineteen. At first, she only flipped, making it eight thousand seven nineteen. But then her friends in the audience were telling her to flip that back and just swap the other half, making it seven thousand eight ninety one. Well, Angela should have done both things. Should have flipped and swapped. It was eight thousand seven ninety one. Hmm. Well, we did get two big wins to end the week. They were in bonus game in Lucky 7, so I'm satisfied about that. Especially that win in Lucky 7. Oh, that was just incredible. Hey, I'm looking forward to Christmas week on The Price is Right. And Yoshian says that something epic is going to happen. Oh, I can't wait to watch that week. Well, until then, you all have a great weekend.